sector in a series of actions to revise and introduce new regulations relating to the industry. Adding that without any revision, the private sector won't be hesitant to invest in the sector. However, these private sectors will need to partner with foreign investors, which further compels the need for new regulations to convince them to invest in the country's EV industry, as well as protect their investments in the long term. And those were the local business news. Up next is the international news and APEC briefing. For advertisements, please write to Voice of Thailand 2022 at gmail.com or call 080-282-6646. FM88, the voice of Thailand. Follow us on YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, and our website. Hi, I'm the voice of Thailand, FM88. Check out our website for news and great content. It's www.fm88-voice-of-thailand.com. Three hyphens, don't forget, and have a great day. PTT shared its effective energy-saving measures at Lessons from the World Energy Crisis, organized by the Ministry of Energy on August 22, 2022. Introduced by experts from Germany, Sri Lanka, Japan, and Thailand, the four core lessons present how PTT has significantly reduced its energy demand. For instance, PTT turns up air conditioners to 26 degrees Celsius, promotes the use of stairs in the place of elevators, and maintains electrical appliances regularly, while also making a habit of switching off unused lights and computers. Setting air conditioners to 26 degrees Celsius is done to reduce PTT's energy consumption and did so by 88,364 units in July this year. Meanwhile, the Take the Stairs campaign cuts greenhouse gas emissions by an average of 114 kilogram carbon dioxide per month. Regarding appliance care, PTT ensured proper cooling tower maintenance to bring benefits equal to 4,632 trees planted this year. On top of the solutions to the energy crisis, these simple practices stand to save millions of baht per year and further drive the aspiration of sustainability for all. FM88, your APAC business news channel and more. APAC briefing. Welcome to APEC Briefing. As the chair and host of APEC 2022, Thailand has put forward the bio-circular green economy as a solution, a cross-cutting, interconnected, and collaborative way of approaching environmental challenges. The aim is to be one of the strategies towards achieving the Putrajaya Vision 2040, as well as the UN Sustainable Development Goals 2030 Goals. A leader's declaration is expected to be developed and endorsed in the final APEC Leaders' Summit meeting in November, and with it, the final text incorporating this proposal. The APEC Policy Unit has developed a policy brief to communicate the key ideas and strategy behind the BCG model. At the outset, the brief addresses the rationale for the model. Firstly, the climate change situation which is worsening. Citing the recent onslaught of typhoons Kinam Nor and Noru, which devastated many communities and disrupted industries in Asia, or Hurricane Ian, which flooded cities across the U.S., and reports of rising seawater slowly encroaching on apex coastal communities. The brief reported that about 167 million people in the APEC region are at risk of being displaced. Indeed, climate change is a common concern for APEC's future prosperity, and rightly so, because many of APEC's other challenges are connected to climate change, such as rising cost of living, creeping hunger or deepening inequalities, among others. The brief starts off by pivoting for a multidisciplinary approach, which the solution to be developed cannot be siloed. It must be cross-cutting, interconnected, and collaborative among APEC economies. One way of developing such solutions is through the bio-circular green 
our BCG economy proposed by Thailand. And that wraps up today's APAC briefing. Stay updated on APAC developments right here on Voice of Thailand, FM 88, Radio Thailand. For advertisement, please write to Voice of Thailand 2022 at gmail.com or call 080-282-6646. With migrant workers being considered a vital part of Thailand's economic growth, the government is moving forward with